Hello everyone, my name is JBR and welcome back to Pokemon Legends Arceus. So we just rested until evening. And Ooh, that was close. So now we have to go. That was an Eevee, wasn't it? Oh, it ran off. Looks like it's starting to get a little dark. Maybe not quite dark enough. Pokemon. And we hit get ominous music. That's a good sign, I guess. reason that these don't work on them is it because they spot me Is this a Remoraid? Is this that guy that I was supposed to find? You're rich. Oh, I have to battle a chattel. Guess this is my chance to catch one. Oh, okay. 
That's not roost. Um, there's one of these flying ones. Stay in there. Awesome. No one told him Pokemon could talk. Alright, so now that we have another base set up out here in the spooky area. Awesome. Destroy this. Ow. Now the dust clubs aren't going to spawn, are they? No, I'm out of space. So what? Uh, oh yeah, getting a nugget. have space for either of these things. So that clears up one space.
clears up one space with something that I'm going to find like immediately. Dustclops, where are they at? And also, healing, where is it at? Actually, I'll take it out. Never know. Oh, shoot, I forgot if I rest, it's gonna pass time. Maybe. What? Where's all the... Where are the ghosts? None of these Pokemon are ghosty enough. Now it's morning. Jerks. This shouldn't be that hard. It is nighttime again. Did, did, did you bring it? You know, the Pokemon with a name that sounds like, um, the Dust Bobs? Yep. Mm -hmm. 
You really brought it? No, no, don't, don't bring it out. Right. I guess, I guess I've got to do my part, seeing how uh, determined you are to go to that island with Basque Legion. Usually I, um, ask Polina if the growl if she takes care of can help me with this bit. But this time you need to help since, well, since we're making this snack so that you'll be accepted by Basque Legion. Once I give you the signal, you have the dust bops of yours use its dark pulse. Three, two, oh no, it's too frightening, but he's already out. Get a grip. Right, so, so counting down to it just makes the anticipation terror worse. Let's simply have you do it when I say go. And go! Delicious aroma wafts through the air. Basculin's favorite snack is now ready. You obtain a ball of Basque Legion food. Crafted in an unusual way from ingredients gathered via unusual methods. Both the aroma and shape are perfect. It's the perfect ball of Basque Legion food. Alright. So, my fucking legs. Hello, Yerba. I, I was just waiting for you. How convenient. Hello, Iskin. Oh, Paulina, I, I thought you said we shouldn't be seen together. What the fuck does that mean? I'm sure Yerba can keep a secret. Besides, both I and the Growlithe pups were eager to meet with the great Basque Legion again. I see. Well, in that case, let me summon Basque Legion. What do you do got going on? Why wouldn't that summon every Digimon that you or Pokemon that you're friends with? Oh, sure. Uh, flying fish. I have to ride this stone. You threw in the ball. Oh, yeah. Oh. The Great Basque Legion. Oh, thank goodness. I was a little worried about whether Basculin would accept this favor. So, here you go. You should let Basculin hear your playing. Basculin opened his heart and learned well the sound of your playing. You received the splash plate. Awesome. Now you can ride Basculin across Tranquility Cove and head to Firespit Island. Growl! 
My congratulations to you, Yehuba. Well, you know, do you want to tell him? I mentioned to you before how the previous lord rescued his Growlithe pup. During this incident, Iskid and Basque Legion saved my life as well. Since then, I've felt a great deal of affection for Iskin here. I truly adore him. But I know there are those who speak ill of me behind my back. So I try to meet with Iskin where there are no prying eyes to preserve his reputation. I, don't, I feel like Iskin wouldn't care too much. Ah, he might. He's got upset that we came to visit him. Oh, I was just doing what any decent person would do when I saved you. Oh, so she doesn't actually like you, but you saved her. Perhaps, but nothing less. After the day, I found the strength to accept Growlithe as he is, and not force him to become the next lord. It was all thanks to the courage you showed me, Iskin. Ah, perhaps we should save this discussion for another time after all. Wow. I bring good luck to my sisters wherever I go, and ill luck to anyone who crosses our path. Oh my god. I'm the eldest, and I'll be your unlucky charm. Thought you spotted a four-leaf clover? Well, I'll soon have you seen double. I'm the middle sister, and I'm one clover you can't pick. Heads I win, tails you lose. You've got no chance in this game of fortunes. I'm the youngest, coin. I'm definitely not your good luck piece. We're the misfortune sisters, known across the frigid land of Haisu, and your luck's just run out. Now get ready to hand over that growler. You want to take my partner? If your aim is to pester us with bad jokes, those ridiculous introduction of yours were more than enough. Y yes, exactly what she said. Now, Gengar. Oh, fuck. Wow, wow. Well, I got the wrong one. Thanks for the growlith fools. We three can't live the kind of lives we want because of narrow-minded groups like the Diamond Clan and the Pearl Clan. If we want to live freely in the great land of Haisu, we need to have powerful Pokemon on our side. But don't worry, we'll make sure this pup grows up nice and strong. We'll even make him a lord for you. Let's take the mutt to our camp and get to work. No one will bother us in a place so miserably hot. No, Growlithe! What should we do here, bro? This is an emergency, right? Well, but, uh, you see, I've never- I've never actually had my partner battle before. Who is your partner? Please, Yerba, I beg you, help us. Please, Yerba, I beg you, help us. My Growlithe is a very, very dear Pokemon to me. Please save him. They said they were going to a place where nobody would bother them. place around the Cobalt Islands that seems suitable is Firespit Island. Oh, now that you have Basculin to help you across the water, you can reach that island too. Across the water, you can reach that island too, please. Could you find it in your to help Pal Polina? Of course. Oh, thank you, Gabriel. You're so kind. We will make our way to Firespit Island as well. Can 
No, Paulina. You should wait here and keep little Growlithe safe. I'm sure he needs you right now. Though I'm not sure if I want to go to an island with lightning and bandits and... No, come here, bro. No time to think. We must go now. You should also know that Basque Legion can jump from the water's surface and then jump once again in the air to go even higher. You can throw items from Basque Legion's back, too. In your case, I guess that would mean throwing Pokeballs to catch Pokemon. Honestly, I have to admit, I'm a little scared. Do you think you could head over first? No, call Basque Legion. Neat. button have to be so complicated um, I guess I'm just gonna save because I don't know what else there is to do except all right um, do a sprint wow this is weird Do it again. Alright. Ow. Sorry. I'm curious how this fight's gonna work exactly. Oh, okay. He gets a little floaty. Oh, fuck. Three of them. Probably gonna knock him out. Yep. Um, I guess, yeah, it would be crazy to try to use. It would be dumb to use a water attack. Graphics here are fantastic. This is how I get to that island? Or is this just a cool path?
Gastrodon. Alright. Man, he's doing a lot of damage for him. For a water type. What is that, a Finneon? My monitor went to sleep. Oh fuck, he's actually too strong. He just needs like a hundred. Just because I don't want to have one faded. Ooh, Fire Spit Island. Certainly hot enough to feel like a sweat bath, isn't it? Now we've got a ghost and bandits to deal with on top of the heat. Very sorry, but do you think you could lead the way, Yagabra? That poor Growlithe. I don't dare imagine what those bandits are doing to him right now. I don't know. Honestly, probably not much. Thank you. 
five, one of these. Nope. I always, for some reason, think B is my run button. Items. Use another great ball at him. Turn around. He listened. I could have done more verses. Oh man. You sh should have saw me. You should have had an even worse field of vision. And one of these is gonna survive these attacks that keep getting stronger. If he tried to run, he was going to get pegged in the back. It's just... Looks like this is where we need to be. One second. It's time to battle. Come on, evolve already. We've done our homework. Any Pokemon gutsy enough to come to this lava trap is supposed to evolve. So get on with it already. You will become stronger, like it or not. Row, row. Stand back, sisters. I'll take care of him. Go, Obama Snow. 
smash this fool to pieces. I was not expecting an Obama Snow. It's gonna. Uh, don't attack me yet, I'm thinking. Uh, Rapidash. Or Star After. Oh, because he's part grass, I think. Oh, nice. I don't get it. How'd I lose? You know, Obamaster can't fight at full power in crazy heat like this. It wasn't a fair battle. They're basically going easy on you. In fact, how dare you make poor Obama snow battle in such a stupidly hot place. You're the one who sent out Obama snow, sister. Go on then, Toxicro. Pour some poison for our unwelcome guests. Now we're facing coin. Coin is, er, Toxic Croak is also weak to flying, isn't he? Yeah. Uh, let's bust out Kadabra. Blithering mooncap I am. How can I let myself loose? I guess I lost lose the coin toss sometimes. I did warn you, didn't I? I had a score to settle with the galaxy team. All the pain and suffering I experienced after coming up here from the Kanto region to work. Kanto. I'm going to make you pay for every last slight. Oh no, she has two Pokemon. Alright, at least I don't have to switch for the to fight his ride on. Cause I can just do this. Super effective here. That's why Kadabra or Gardevoir, I think you're slightly better. Because if Gengar knows any dark moves. Oh fuck, it's a poison move. That's right. What a disgrace. 
Oh wow, three level ups. That's fantastic. <laughs> How could all of us have been? Hey, Charm, I healed up a bomb of snow and coins toxic croak. Good as new. Now we can keep battling until we run out of potions. It'd be so funny if they kept battling. Wow. What do we think? Is it going to evolve? What? Hey, no one invited you, Tiny. You're really going to insist on getting in the way, you little runt? Wow. Take him down, Toxic Crow. No, it's hot, but hang in there, Obama Snow. Smash that run. Grandma, please stop. You cannot beat such foes. But Paulina, what are you doing here? Thought you were waiting with little Growler. I was, but then he jumped into the ocean without warning and swam all the way here. Into the ocean? But he was terrified of the ocean after it swallowed up the former lord. Is he not dead? No, he's been gone for years. Oh, wow. Look, like looks like he finally found his courage. The late Lord's child. He's evolved. His true bravery lay not in crossing the sea, but... Ah, oh, you didn't get to read that. You gotta be joking me. Why'd the puny little one evolve? Uh, sisters, something's not right. Oh, that's not right. Is he, is he gonna get hit by lightning? Oh, he's going into a frenzy right here? Entei? Uh, the one from Sun and Moon? What? Paulina, stay back! Wow. What's happened to him? That strange lightning hit him. He's become frenzied, just like the other nobles. Well, this is exactly why I didn't want to come to this island. Everything was going just as we'd wanted before that awful mutt ruined everything. Enough of this, sisters. We leave this place. We won't be making any living without our lives. What happened to the other Growlithe? Oh, there. Now it's there. Hey, wait! This is all your fault. We should get out of here too, Polina. Otherwise, we're fair game for Arcanine. Come on, Yagibra. We should hurry. Polina. What are you going to do about Growlithe? I mean, Arcanine. That dear little Pokemon is my responsibility. As his warden, it is my duty to protect him everything I have. Yeah, bro, what must we do to quell this frenzy? Please tell us what we need. We'll need to make some bombs. Bombs? Irida, what are you talking about? I'm the leader of our clan. Is it so surprising that I know a little more of these things than you, Lena? I held my tongue for the first time. Now I must insist. 
Stop calling me Lena in front of everyone. Yes, well aware you're our leader, Irina. How can I forget that you were the chosen one? You who can use your Celestica flute to summon Pokemon and have them carry you to even the farthest reaches of High Sea. I've learned a little about these frenzies as well. It's a special method for dealing with them. Of the Lord's favorite foods and throw them from a safe distance. Isn't that right, Yagabra? Well, in that case, I do always carry some of Grella's favorite food with me, so I can thank him when he uses his flame to help prepare Basque Legion's favorite meal. Why, Iskin, once again your thoughtfulness saves the day. Now we can make those bombs. Right away. Yeah, let's get to right to work. They're ready. Here are the bombs we need. Please let me know when you feel prepared to try to quell Lord Arcanine's frenzy. Alright, um... Let's just look, uh... Eh, we can use some health. Let's see, 100s or 60s. Saved. All right, now let's go. Let's go. Are you ready, Jagerbra? Yes, I am ready. He may have finally become a lord, but it's clear his frenzy is causing him to suffer greatly. Be on your guard. The late Lord Arcanine would launch devastating attacks after standing still, gathering light around himself. Remember that while you're dodging, moves will slip right by you. Good luck. Alright. Oh no. He can walk in lava. sure how to dodge from some of these spots. Don't hurt me from back here. Like, that didn't come up before. With the Lily can't fight. That fire being in that middle, probably. Um. Well, the the, the fire was. I don't know what hit me. That means he's preparing to hit him with his baseball. You can't. Yeah, I did that. I guess we're start battle, continue battle. What is continue battle? 
Uh, yeah, keep the previous progress. Him? Yeah. I thought he'd stop like mid run. I didn't think he'd keep going. Strange light has left Arcanine and is vanishing into the space time rift. You received the flame plate. could possibly lie on the other side of the rift, I wonder. <laughs> what? Was that two different Arcanine cries just now? He's not gonna be over there now, is he? Oh, now I understand. You and I must now live apart so that we may attend to our separate duties. From now on, let us each strive to fulfill our duties as Lord and Warden. Now go, Lord Arcanine, your realm awaits. Um, was I the only one who felt like they heard the cry of the previous Lord Arcanine earlier? Oh, how odd. I certainly didn't. Oh, please, I do hope you're joking. I'm easily scared as it is. What am I going- what am I to do if I start hearing the cries of ghosts all the time? No need to worry, Iskin. I only kid. I also heard the lord of the previous lord calling out to us. Seems like I wasn't the only one watching over this young pup the whole, whole time. Here, bro, you have my heartfelt thanks for helping my dear little one. The new Lord Arcanine. Sorry to ask even more of you, but please look after Irida as well. Now then, Iskin, I believe we'd best be off. Yeah, bro.
You know, when Lena wouldn't raise Growlithe to be the new lord, and people in our clan were doubting her fitness as a warden, I urged her to put Growlithe through the proper training, but she snapped at me. This poor Pokemon saw his own father die, she told me. Is it a warden's duty to force a child in such pain through that training? Those words left me with much to consider. And even when Ark and I became Lord of the Isles and grew frenzied, all I could do was watch. What about the bombs? Please, all I did was arrive late and help explain about the bombs. Something you could have done without me. Is that so praiseworthy? Do I deserve to be recognized for such a slight contribution? I took on leadership of the Pearl Clan so young, with no grand vision for what it should be. Still, I tried to respect our old customs and sights, even as some called me old-fashioned for it. But watching you, I finally see. I know what I want to do. I want to protect this vast land of Haisu. Grant me another battle someday, Yairu. I want to battle alongside my partner so we can grow strong enough to be of help to you and to broaden the horizons of the world I see. Looks like I've got Lena to thank for yet another lesson that I've learned. I should let her know and hear more about her relationship with Warden Iskin while I'm at it. Here's where we part for now, Yerbra. I need to get off this oven of an island. So that's the end of this. Can I like fast travel back to? Oh, well that's cool. Um, I guess yeah. Grade my team or my cap captures. Oh, ten grand. See if this. Let's see if any of this can level me up. Ah, close. You quelled the new Lord Arcanine. Oh, let's tell Commander Kamado the good news. Then shall we? Back to Jubilee we go. I forget if this just takes me right into it or not, or if I still have to walk up to him. Yeah. So I'm going to end this episode here. So next time we will talk to him and I don't know, I guess continue on with our next mission. So thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.